Hi my friends, my name is Eva and I'm still a nutritionist, still here, still with you guys. And today we're going to talk about one of the most crucial and important amino acids in our body. The precursor of the serotonin, the precursor of the secretion of melatonin, the amino acid which is by definition responsible for the prevention of the stress and for muscular pain. This amino acid is the tryptophan and today we're going to debunk every single myth. We're going to talk about the science explained behind this magical amino acid. So are you ready? Are you with me? So let's go. Behind this somewhat barbaric name hides a very precious ally for our organism. It is the precursor of the secretion of the serotonin which is by definition the hormone of the happiness. It is one of the most important amino acids to just basically feel good. <laughs> what are the benefits of the tryptophan? How to identify a deficiency and what food shall we prefer? All the information in this video today, tonight. <laughs> you know what I mean, let's go. Tryptophan is part of the family of the amino acids and the most important part of the family of the essential amino acids. The thing is that the fraction of a protein is constructed with little dosage of amino acid which are bond together. So basically amino acid bond, amino acid bond, amino acid bond and etc. The thing is that the essential amino acid are not secreted in our organism by themselves. They have to be brought in our food ratio, so from an external source. There are eight essential amino acids for adults, leucine, isoleucine, tryptophan, and etc., and nine for children. So the thing is that the tryptophan is the rarest amino acid in the 20 amino acids that exists in our well-being. Moreover, it's very fragile and it's very easily distracted with acidic components in our body. The essential action of the amino acids, which the tryptophan occur in the nerve system. It plays a key role in the brain activity and is the main participant in the secretion of the serotonin and the melatonin, which is our neurotransmitters and hormones. Serotonin simply allows the communication between nerve cells. This neurotransmitter always plays a key role in the regulation of our mood, the sleep and society. So <laughs> the level of your so Merde alors! <laughs> Votre sociabilité, yo! Uh, <laughs> ah. Your sociability! I got it. Melatonin, on the other hand, is the um, hormone of the sleep. It is derived directly from the serotonin, which is formed by the tryptophan. Melatonin is made during the night to promote relaxation, the quality of the sleep, and the regulation of your biochemical rhythms. Finally, the tryptophan is responsible for the formation of the vitamin B3, also known as niacin and vitamin P. <laughs> The crucial role of this vitamin is to transform the carbohydrates into energy. So the formation of the molecule of ATP, the fast energy, as we all know. It also regulates the stress hormones and, moreover, the regulation of the cholesterol. So the prevention of the cardiovascular diseases. So to recap, without tryptophan, our body cannot produce the neurotransmitter, the serotonin, the hormone of the sleep, melatonin, and the vitamin B3, which are crucial components of our well-being and for the maintenance of a good mood in our body. But this essential amino acid is also involved in other very crucial roles in our body. First of all, fight against depression, prevention of degenerative diseases, relieve muscular chronic pain. A little warning over here. When the body shows a deficiency in the vitamin B3, most of the intake of the tryptophan is used to fill this blank of the deficiency of the vitamin B3 and is not distributed to the brain. So, to enjoy the benefits of the tryptophan on our nerve system, do not hesitate to consume food which are very rich in vitamin B3. Red meat, fish, brown rice, nuts, seeds, legumes and 
my favorite bananas bananas <laughs> 5-HTPO, 5-hydroxytryptophan, is an essential amino acid which is made from the tryptophan himself. Once in the brain, it is directly transformed into the neurotransmitter of the serotonin. It is the perfect form to enjoy every single benefit of the tryptophan in our action brain. The good news is that 5-HTP is found in a plant, which is the... Griffonia. So while you are choosing your food supplementation, uh, please just make a quick stop and look at Griffonia supplementation in very concerted form. And this magical plants would make you happy for sure. Now let's talk about the deficiencies. The deficiencies in uh, essential amino acids are common because of the variety of the diets, because of your food choices and etc. Tryptophan, because it is an essential amino acid, it founds mainly in animal sources of your food. People who are following, um, let's say, vegan or vegetarian lifestyle are more concerned about the deficiency in tryptophan. So I highly recommend to talk about this to your doctor, to your, I don't know, medical consultant or whatsoever and to understand the importance of the tryptophan to avoid those mood swings, sleeping problems and etc. And, and just find the right food supplements in tryptophan, 5-HTP, vitamin B3 and melatonin to compensate this blink and this blank <laughs> of tryptophan in your organism. The lack of tryptophan is aggravated by the fact this amino acid is stored very little by the body. The release in our blood is very short and lasts barely four hours. To feel the benefits of the tryptophan, it is therefore important to be healthy and to maintain the several dosage while you are consuming the tryptophan per day. There are different symptoms to identify a deficiency in tryptophan and if you can identify yourself in those symptoms, please don't hesitate to supplement yourself in the dose of tryptophan. Sleep disorders, difficulty to fall asleep, uh, apnea of the sleep, and insomnia, loss of appetite, mood disorders, depression, anxiety, headaches, stunting, and finally digestive problems. For a healthy adult, it is recommended to consume 500 milligrams of tryptophan to 2,000 milligrams of tryptophan per day. Food rich in tryptophan rather be consumed at the end of the day or early evening, at the time of the secretion of the serotonin in our brain. This will promote sleep and promote and be, <laughs> let's say, a prevention of nighttime cravings. Tryptophan is mostly found from food of animal origin. Prefer white meats such as chicken and turkey, fish, yogurts, um, cheese, milk, every single daily product, all of these animal sources contain lots and lots and lots of tryptophan, my friends. Fortunately, tryptophan is also present in plant food, such as seeds, sunflower seeds, chia seeds, and pumpkin seeds. And now my favorite, and we're gonna conclude with this, the chocolate. The chocolate is the king of uh, antioxidants, magnesium and also tryptophan. The cacao beans are so rich in tryptophan that you can basically see this as a cure. So do yourself, do myself <sighs> a pleasure and just grab a piece of chocolate, put a movie that you like, uh, make yourself a warm cup of milk and just enjoy your tryptophan pleasure. Et à ceci, and as usual, bisous bisous, et à bientôt. <laughs> Tryptophan is my king. Tryptophan is my king. It's actually so late, maybe I should really make myself a warm cup of milk or whatsoever. Yeah. By the way, I really enjoy making this video. I love it. I love it. Like it. Okay, I'm gonna finish on this one. <laughs>